Feedmaster is a local producer and supplier of technologically advanced animal feed products. Now that the ban on importing poultry from neighboring South Africa has been lifted, Feedmaster's technical nutritionist, Monogastric Dala Duplessy, says this is a positive development for the industry. Dala is, however, concerned about the sourcing of raw material, saying producers such as Feedmaster must ensure that they get raw material that is not contaminated to protect the local industry. For the current situation in Namibia, it's, it's, not, it's not only a bad thing. Because we really need to protect our industry. As soon as we've got AI in, in Namibia, the whole poultry industry will shut down. So we need to be very careful where we get what from. Feedmaster produces about 4,200 tons of broiler feed products per month. The mixing and formulation is done in Namibia. The question many Namibians have in mind is where does bird flu come from and how does it spread? AI is a virus carried mostly by, by wild birds, so any migratory wild birds or wild birds that, that you find um, basically all over Namibia may be carriers and then they shed the virus in their droppings and should your chickens or ostriches or anything then come into contact with these droppings then they can contract the virus. Avian influenza or IA as known to the professionals in the field is a highly contagious disease which affects primarily chickens, ducks and turkeys but can affect other avian species too. Duplessis further says that the problem with the feed imported from South Africa is that they contain potentially contaminated residues from wild bird carcasses and droppings from dead birds. Feedmaster insists the feed they produce locally contains none of those things. Jose Jean, NBC, Okapuka.